Thank you very much for joining. My name is Darren Joseph from HCJ.tat. We're a team that seeks to demystify the sometimes confusing world of cross-border taxation. And today we have the honor and privilege of joining us, Claudia Vasconcelos. Please introduce yourself. Well, uh, thank you, Darren, first of all, for inviting me. It's a pleasure to be here. And thank you for the opportunity to discuss and explain the advantages of investing and living in Madeira. This is a topic that is very dear to me. I'm born and raised uh, on the islands. Uh, I am currently head of business development of NUCO. We are a one-stop shop for investors and expatriates in Portugal. We're headquartered in Madeira. Um, and most of my career has been dedicated and devoted to the attraction of foreign investments to Portugal specifically to Madeira or mostly in particular to Madeira. Uh, I've actually worked for about 18 years in the entity that was that is still today the government entity in charge of promoting the International Business Center of Madeira. And for the past 10 years, I uh, joined NUCO and we are actively promoting and assisting investors and expats um, relocating in Portugal and particularly in Madeira. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you. Another thing that makes the regime in Madeira quite interesting is that it's, I mean, obviously, Portugal is a civil law jurisdiction, yet there is a concept of a trust. Could you comment on that, please? Yes. Well, when mm. the regime was created, um, we wanted to be competitive. And we mm -hmm. understood that main, the, the, for the investors would come and did come in the beginning, especially uh, mm -hmm. mostly from Anglo-Saxon jurisdictions that were more yeah. familiar and experienced uh, mm -hmm. with uh, foreign investment, especially in low tax jurisdictions. So we understood mm -hmm. that it was important to have this mechanism that is widely mm -hmm. used in Anglo-Saxon countries. So in spite Portugal, despite mm -hmm. the fact that Portugal, as you mentioned, it's a, a civil law country, does not recognize the, 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 the figure of trusts, it, the Portuguese government created a specific law to allow mm -hmm. the, the creation of trusts within the international uh, business center of Madeira. But it has mm -hmm. limitations or okay. mm -hmm. specifically the, the trusts must be created and um, regulated by a foreign law. So mm -hmm. uh, it's not the Portuguese law that applies because it doesn't mm -hmm. exist. You must mm -hmm. choose the law that will regulate the, the, the administration and the management of the trusts. So this added to the fact that mm -hmm. in terms of tax benefits, it not, may not be uh, as competitive as other um, uh, jurisdictions, eh? traditional trust mm -hmm. jurisdictions in fact it's not a common it in practice we don't see uh the mm -hmm. creation it's not often to get to how to see the creation of trust in madeira it's possible and it's mm -hmm. something that we can uh look into and try to implement but it's not something that is very common even though the law mm -hmm. in fact foresees that Okay, so it needs to be a foreign jurisdiction. So you need to specify what the foreign jurisdiction is. Yes, and the tr the trustee needs to be Madeira resident. Yes, it must be okay. a Madeira company. The it must trustee. be a Madeira company. A Madeira okay. company licensed within the international of the business center. So you see these type mm -hmm. of limitations and mm -hmm. the lack of our, of experience. I would say mm -hmm. and know how in 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 Portugal uh, makes it a bit mm -hmm. difficult and harder to compete mm -hmm. so that because that, that that is quite interesting because remember I, we were saying earlier that one of the entity types that is not well not encouraged in terms of incentives would be financial services but the exception to that could be a trustee so you can create a, a trustee company yes and um, okay, and would that trusty company enjoy the five percent, assuming their substance and whatever? Yes, okay. yes. So when mm -hmm. we talk about financial entities, it's mm -hmm. uh, financial regulated entities, right? And, right, and, and then and trustee. supervised, yes, right. and, and it's not trust on to regulate so to the supervised. The case. Okay, yes. right. So, so for some, you know, for some uh, use cases, that could be quite interesting. You know, having, yeah. I understand that, and it's a question. Mm -hmm. It's uh, an area that we could explore. 
Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm just saying we don't have the practical experience. So. Right. So in, in your time dealing with, you know, various entities and so on in Madeira, uh, what was the most, of course, and, um, you know, not without betraying who it was or whatever, but what's the most interesting use of a Madeira trust that you have seen? Just so that we can get a sense for what an interesting I haven't use. dealt specifically okay. with trust, Darren, so um, okay. I can't comment on that. I don't have a okay. practical experience mm-hmm. on it. To give you mm-hmm. an idea of the, in mm-hmm. terms overall, since the beginning uh, of numbers, there's about 15 trusts, oh. 20 trusts. So it's wow. a limited, quite a limited application, yes. Madeira yeah. is... Uh, very competitive and interesting, I would say, to mm-hmm. um, for companies who for services trading companies uh, enter is in specifically entering the, EU, the European Union market. That's where we can mm-hmm. make a difference. Um, so it's a gateway to Europe. Holding okay. holding mm-hmm. companies and trading mm-hmm. services companies, all types of uh, services companies. That's where mm-hmm. we, I believe, we are really competitive. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. Okay. All right. M- makes sense. So if you're a six, seven, or eight-figure investor, entrepreneur, or business owner who needs a tailor-made solution from a qualified team of professionals, we can help you achieve the international lifestyle, the freedom, and even the tax savings you're looking for. Visit us at htj.tax and live that international life.